When Sean Pangilinan was 21 years old, he left Guam to pursue a degree in health sciences. His goal? To help people through fitness. It was a goal inspired by an internship with SOAR Physical Therapy Clinic here. I was very interested in how they were helping people through movement. Um, I was very fascinated how people would come in with back pains, with neck pains, knee pains, elbow pains, and uh, they would they would help them through exercises. And when I saw that, I, I that's when the spark occurred. Like, oh, I think this is the direction I want to take my life and potential career in to helping people. And that's what helped me make the move to go to uh, San Diego. Wanting to bring the concept of the gym into a physical therapy clinic, the Fit Lab was officially opened in San Diego on June 1st, 2015, with the mission to what Pangolinan has also focused on is helping fathers, something he attributes to becoming a parent himself and also his father. My father just passed away um, a little over a month ago, almost two months now. And, um, you know, he, he, he died of, of health reasons. And uh, for the last probably five to 10 years, he was really suffering because of the health issues he's had. He has a newfound spark in his motivation and passion to help people. And his mission and drive seems to have caught the eye of others. Recently, Sean was featured in a digital series by Project Rock, which highlighted three fathers who put in the work to show up every day as their best selves for their families. Project Rock, which is a collaboration by The Rock and Under Armour, used the series to promote their limited edition Ohana pack in time for Father's Day. Sean said it all started with the manager from The Rock's Seven Bucks production. He really liked what I what I was doing with my with my uh, with my Instagram. He really liked the message I was trying to share as far as being a father, uh, being a trainer, being a coach, you know, being a husband. Um, and yeah, they asked me if I wanted to be a part of it. And I was like, heck yeah, I want to be a part of it. No questions asked. For about eight hours, a production crew followed Sean around while he was training his clients and exercising. For almost two hours, they interviewed him. He described the process as raw and emotional. They also shot Sean with his family, paddling with his three boys in tow. That day was just a, um, a reassurance, if anything, that, you know, like what I'm doing is I'm on the right track with what I'm doing in life. And I, I felt very, very blessed to be able to share that. Um, and so when I saw the end product, you know, I was very proud because, um, you know, the, I, I, I've always tried to share the message of follow your heart, find your passion, and, you know, just keep doing it. And uh, that day was just that. And like many of us who sometimes find it hard to take the first step towards getting healthy. I totally understand the situations, you know, that you have, you know, priorities, responsibilities, you have bills to pay, you know, you have, you know, you have to take care of your kids. Yeah, there's so many aspects in life that you have to take care of and it can be frustrating, it could be overwhelming, it could seem almost impossible. But, you know, if you're ever looking for a strong motivation, if you're ever looking for a why, you just have to look at your kids. I think you'll find the motivation the inspiration and the desire to be able to improve yourself one day at a time. Reporting for KM News, I'm Jonah Gancharfres.